Okay, we're going to do a demonstration today on the Kellenberger 600U. That's a universal IDOD grinder. We have a headstock that uh, can swivel and a wheel head that can swivel. And that back turns completely around and you can have an ID uh, spindle in there and, and do ID grinding work on the, on the chuck. Now uh, we have a tailstock. We have a uh, special dresser here. A micrometer adjustment for doing the side of the wheel and the front of the wheel. And of course, this is uh, raised up quite a bit there. Uh, I don't know the exact dimensions, but we're going to run the machine for you. So, this is your emergency stop. You want to make sure that's off. We started the hydraulics, we started the spindle. cycle in the plunge grinding mode. We'll bring the wheel slide forward and start the work head. And at the same time start the feed down here on the hand wheel. Gets to a fine feed. It starts feeding at a finer feed rate. Until you get to zero. And it will automatically kick out after a certain amount of time. So we can show that once again. The slide comes in, the work head speed is adjustable, it's a fine feed. Okay. If you want to do uh, traverse grinding with the machine, you can put it in. It's kind of a mode. Time the table reverses, you get a, a feed on the handle. Now, with this select the switch, you can select whether or not you want to feed on both sides of the part or just on the left side or the right side. This is the hand mode, just to work the machine by hand, and this would be your, your plunge feed mode. Have a dwell for the left side, a dwell for the right side, as well as the table speed. Okay, this will feed down to zero at the appropriate time, it will spark out. The whole operation is controlled by this one lever. When you work the lever, you start the head coming in, the table, the work head, as well as the in feed. And when you retract it, it also retracts your in feed amount. Put it back the way you started. You have the digital readout, Sony digital readout. Uh, we have here a mechanism for adjusting the taper on the table. You can mount an indicator in here, and um, when you make your adjustment, you can have an indicator. We also have a sign bar mounted on the work head. You're going to do some uh, angles, uh, to swivel the work head at a certain angle degrees. The sign bar for that. You have a coolant tank and some extra accessories. You can be seen in the still photos. 